Okay, you guys, today we are doing a segment called Dr. Moon Does Fact Versus Fiction, Anesthesia Edition. So these are questions that were submitted by uh, people who wanted to know certain facts about anesthesia. The first one is, people who drink a lot may need more anesthesia than people who don't. That is actually true. Alcohol is a sedative and it acts on the same receptors as some anesthetics. So chronic heavy drinkers do in fact need more anesthesia. It's possible to wake up during surgery. It's true. There's a phenomenon called awareness under anesthesia. And that means you're awake when you're not supposed to be awake. That probably also means that something else bad is going on, which means you're having a stat C-section, meaning maybe the baby's not doing well and they need to get it out immediately, or you're a trauma patient, or you're bleeding out. Those are the circumstances when we turn down the anesthesia because your blood pressure and your heart rate aren't doing so well. And then right when your brain starts to perfuse a little bit, if we're just a little bit behind in catching up your anesthesia, you may be awake and paralyzed and remember it. But it's very, very rare. Redheads need more anesthesia than other people. That is true. So redheads are, um, they have a gene that prevents them from having more melanin, which is why they're fair skinned and have red hair. That gene also affects how much anesthesia you need. So there are certain studies that people have done showing that redheads on average need about 15 to 20% more anesthesia than their non redheaded counterparts. Being heavy can increase your risk of complications with anesthesia. That is true as well. Um, obesity affects all the organ systems in the body, especially the airway, the heart, the lungs, and that can affect the way you metabolize different anesthetic drugs, so you may need more or less depending on which kind of drug. That's all we have for today, but you guys can drop a comment below and ask me some of your anesthesia or other medical related questions, and I'll tell you if they're false or true. Bye.